Hi all. I wanted to talk with you about a list of all religions and belief systems. So yeah. So let me let me crack on crack on with the first one. It's called agnostic agnostic agno, agnosticism agnosticism. I think it's just I think it's just called in called in short agnost, agnostics. So so it's just it's just agnosticism. It's just about the belief of of a god exists by nature, unknown, unknown or unknowable by by evidence or with evidence, lack or, and with and with and they need, they need proof of evidence. So so they need they, so they don't know if so it's a case of whether they need evidence of the existence existence of God and 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 whether God is on un, God is known or unknown that they and and they cannot they not conclude if God exists so what I would, what I would say to that is I would just just keep keep searching and keep looking and also try and ask 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 someone from church about it i would say but don't give up in in your don't give up don't give up in your search don't just let it lie but it's also a slight agnosticism is a, is a little bit of a rebellion as well a bit like a bit a bit like atheism so so yeah don't give up in searching and um and and and, and as always i would say to people suicide is not the answer and you know that's that's the form of giving up and also like I, like, like I would say as well to to anyone I know I would I would say if you're not happy in your in your in your circumstances or situation or job or lifestyle if you're not happy with it or circumstances just seek God seek Jesus seek Jesus Christ and let him be your personal lord and savior but do watch the rest of this video because I'm going to go on a bit further. So, so don't don't reject Jesus. Don't reject God, because He will bless you at the, at the right time. And it's not about blessing. This is about following God, and then letting and letting Him impart His spirit, His spirit, and His His understanding in our in our lives. So yeah, and this one, this one that's this new this other religion called. It's called Amish. So that religion, Amish, is a peaceful Christian fundamental group, famous for re famous for rejecting technology and adherence to OT and NT laws. So that's like serious Christians that don't do nothing to do with Christianity. Sorry. That serious Christians, that's, that 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 wants nothing to do with, with the with the current world that we're living in. Uh, don't want don't, don't want to embrace technology. Just wants to be as basic as possible. Yeah. Uh, it's not for me to judge about that. If a Christian wants to live like that, you know, it's 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 like the Bible says, you know, if if somebody eats eats a food that's this detest detestable, we shouldn't. We shouldn't really judge them by by what about we should we shouldn't really judge people like it says in the Bible by what they eat or what they do. It's up to, it's up to them and God, and what God has re revealed to them. So yeah, I will move on. So this one called An Anist Anista worship. I do believe this is communicating with the dead. It looks like ancestor worship. A N C E S T E. Sorry, that's spell A N C E S T O R, and then it's worship W O R S H I P. So yeah, it's it's talking talking about a form of shamanism and tribal ancestry spirits. So the only spirit that we need to worry about is the Holy Spirit, Godhead, 
God the Father, God the Son, God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. So they're the only ones that we need to worry. That's the only spirit we need to worry about. Any other spirits, we should, we, we should try and be careful of what kind of spirit we're listening to. Because some of them, well not some of them, all of them will, re, will lead to destruction. Because it will lead us to sin. And like I said, suicide is never the answer to, to any problems that we that we face. We should always over, we should always overcome our problems in prayer and reading the word, reading reading the Bible. And this one, this next one is called animism. Animism. So. So animism, which is spelled A N I M A N I M I S M. So it's it's a religion in the Western sense about believing in objects and spirits. So it's always you know that's a bit that's a bit that's a that's that's a bit of, that's a lot to do with that's a lot to do with that's a lot to do with devil worshiping because it's talking about other spirits and traditional form of beliefs like basic traditional stuff so that that that's going to be a, be devil worshiping in some sense or some way and the next one is the next one is as as such true which is spelled a s a t r u It's a Nordic religion, the A S A T R U. It's a it's a it's a Nordic religion, which is I would have thought something to do with that. Would, that would, that will be some form of that would, that will be some form some form form of devil worshiping if it's not mentioning all those all those those three godhead like the three godhead like. God the Son, God the Father, and God the Holy Spirit. God, the, that's God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. If he's if he's not talking about that in the Nordic religion, that means he's got. And if he's talking about another religion or another faith, it's that's not to do not that that does not have those three in ones. God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. If he's not talking about those, then it's obviously something something to do with devil worshiping or or the demonic or Satanism. So this one, atheism, A T H E I S M. I think that's for atheists. But I look. So atheism is spelled A T H E I S M. I'm sure you know how to spell it anyway. So it's a, it's just a lack of belief in God, the disbelief in God he, that he exists. Or the, or the lack of knowledge, not being, not believing in God because of that, and it's also in, and and with with that, with in local culture, it says. So the next one is. Aum Aum, Shinriko Shinri Kirik, Shin Shinri Kyo, which is spelled A U M space. S H I N R I K Y O. So the um, Amu Shinriko, which I spell it again, I think I've spelled, spelled it already, but I'll spell it again. It's A U M S H I N R I K Y O. Dangerous, violent, religious community responsible. Yeah. Uh, responsible for the serene gas attack. So um, they eventually apologize. It says stop and then stop using the Bible. For more pay prosaic group called uh, Al Aluf And the last but not least for the for this for this video, it's Baha Bahai faith, which is spelled B A H B A B A H. Sorry, that's B A H. Okay, I'm getting tired. So, for unnecessary, unnecessary reason, 
unnecessary reasons. So B A H A space I faith. So Baha faith B A H B A H A I B A H A space I faith. So it's a series of prophets have come from God and Baha is the latest religion founded founded by God a liberal offshoot of Islam so it's a liberal offshoot of Islam and and but per, but persecuted in Iran so yeah so I don't know if you heard me I'll say it again belief of series of prophets from God Baha is a religion religion founded by God liberal offshoot of Islam but persecuted in Iran so yeah that's really all I have to say but let me see if I can I'll try hang on a minute so yeah that's really it so if you guys are confused of what God of what God to serve what kind of religion to serve or the one faith just get in contact with me or get get in contact with whoever whoever you whoever you see you see gave you this video so or just get in contact with any contact details that's on on this video because i can teach you how to feel the presence of god because god god is god is real and I can teach you how to feel the presence, the presence of God. Like he's, you can feel it on your skin, in your body. So God is real. God is real. God wants to bless us and to protect us. Anything that the devil speaks, it's always a curse. That the devil always speaks a curse on, on our lives, on human beings' lives. He, he hates human beings with an overwhelming... Um, um, over, the devil hates human beings with an overwhelming passion. And God, God always speaks blessings in our lives. Every time God speaks, He speaks blessings and speaks prosperity in our lives. But the devil speaks curses every time He speaks in our life. So we should not give access to the devil at all in our lives. But every time, but we should try and try our best to give our give 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 God access to our life. We should try and do that and let let God have access to our lives, because God always speaks blessings to our lives. God never changes, and the devil never changes. God is good. God is good, and the devil is bad. Jesus is good. The Holy Spirit is good. God the Father is good. God the Holy Spirit is good. God the Son is good, which is Jesus. But the devil is all bad. Satan is bad. The devil is bad. Devil worshiping is bad. So get in contact with me whenever you're ready. But now, but but like the like the good old Bible says, and the current Bible says. Now is the hour of salvation. Don't delay. Get in contact with me as soon as you hear my video. Sorry, as soon as you finish watching my video. But get in contact with me as soon as you, as soon as, as soon as possible. Because like the like the like like I said, now is now is the time of salvation. Don't leave it till tomorrow, because tomorrow you, you might you might get you, you don't tomorrow you're not even guaranteed your your next breath. You don't even guarantee your next breath after this. You you. We're not we're not always we're not always guaranteed our next breath all the time. It's it's by the grace of God that we live. It's it's by the grace of God that we breathe. God God controls our God control our God controls our our mouths, our our bodies. You should have a look at one of my videos where I talk about the last the last days of a of a last last evangelist from strike one to strike seven I've I've done in, in parts. So have a look at that video and it shows you how God is God controls my, my mouth and how God is controlling my mouth all the time. And and at one point I thought I was ending it I was ending it as a lifestyle evangelist, but it's not real I'm not really. God has reopened my, my, my case as in my calling. So I'll always preach as a lifestyle evangelist. So God is fully in control of God is fully in God is fully in control of the bad and the good, but choose good, and don't get fed up of it because it's it's worth it in the end. You you will reap what you sow. If you if you sow bad, you reap bad. If you sow good, you will sow you you reap good. So if you sow bad, you reap bad. 
if so if you sow bad you reap bad if you so if you sow good you reap if you sow bad you reap bad if you sow good you so you you reap good that's what I'm trying to say sorry about the confusion on my words but I'll say it one more time if you sow bad you reap bad death and destruction but if you sow good you reap good and blessings and honor if you sow good in your life whatever you do whatever you do it, it's either good or bad whatever we do in our lives whatever we say in our lives is either good or bad it's down to us to, to follow follow God God doesn't God doesn't God doesn't boss us about if we freely we freely we freely choose God God doesn't force our force himself upon us God freely chooses us God God we freely choose God but God already chose us before 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 we before we were ever born but yeah but it's down to us to, to finally choose choose God the first time or maybe once again but it's down to us to finally choose God once he's already chosen us before the foundation of the earth or before before our before we were ever born so yeah that's really all I have to say well let me pray with you if you don't mind so Heavenly Father thank you for your grace and mercy put upon us from past present and future pray heal us right now Father pray minister unto us oh God help us to feel your presence right right now even now as we pray oh God help us to feel your presence oh God help us to know you're in this room oh God in Jesus name we plead the blood of Jesus Christ in our lives Father pray not to fall upon us we plead the blood of Jesus in our situation. We plead the blood of Jesus in our situation. We plead the blood of Jesus in our situation. We plead the blood of Jesus in our situation. We plead the blood of Jesus in our situation. We plead the blood of Jesus in our situation. We plead the blood of Jesus in our situation. And pray grace and mercy will, will, will be upon us, Father. Pray your hand be upon us, O God. Pray your hand be upon our lives, O God. Protect us, O God. Rescue us, O God. From our, from our problems, rescue us, O God. Help us to rely on you, O God, each and every day. We plead the blood of Jesus Christ in our situation. We pray these things all in Jesus name we pray amen so if you feel anything or anything at all or you feel different or you feel different in any way get in contact with me or get in go on, get in contact with the person that shared you this video so yeah that's all I have to say for now so God bless and I'll see you in the next video bye for now